What is going on you guys, this is x 4 member of the Gaming Intel team and today we're going to take a look at the Infinite Warfare graphics comparison between the PS4 and the Xbox One. So what I have is three maps using the same weapon at the same spot and the exact same settings. Nothing has changed, this is all recorded using my Elgato HD60, recording at 1080p at 60 frames per second. Now looking at the map for us, you can see that on the PS4 side it has a bit more brightness than the Xbox One, but that could just be the settings aren't exactly there. And looking at the weapons, there seems to be no serious difference in detail. Taking a look side by side though, you can actually notice a bit of difference on the floor where the snow is and the PS4 seems to have a bit more detail, but you really don't notice it unless you really focus. Now jumping over to the map throwback, once again there's barely any difference in detail. There seems to be a bit more difference on the floor and grass on the Xbox One side, but from afar there seems to be more detail on the bricks and windows on the PS4 side. Here's a side by side comparison and you can actually notice a bit of it but it's really not that serious. Now when we go to the final map which is Frontier, this map actually has the most noticeable detail but once again it's not that serious. On the Xbox One side you notice a bit more detail near the ceiling and on the left side compared to the PS4. There's also some extra detail on the floor and near the door. Now if we go a step further and look at the cinematic intro before every match, we can see that in Frost on the PS4 there's a bit more detail on the left side and a bit on the ice but overall everything looks about the same. In Throwback, there's no difference except the lemonade stand. There seems to be a shadow added on the PS4, but there's some light on the inside on the Xbox One. Everything else looks about the same in detail. And finally, going into the map Frontier, there's really no details changes except there's some extra light added to the PS4 and a couple of color changes as well. But overall, these are really just minor changes and you won't notice them unless you really focus. But let us know what you guys think about this in the comments below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, and Twitch. As always, this is X4, member of the Gaming Intel team, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.